Adam Joseph Dewey grew up in Reserve, Louisiana, where he dreamed of playing big-time football. His dream was to be a quarterback. When his football dream became a reality, instead of playing quarterback, Dewey became a quarterback's nightmare. At Godshaw, A.J. was the only player in his district to be selected all-district on both offense and defense. And he punted for a 36-yard average. At the Louisiana High School All-Star Game, he blocked three punts while starring on both sides of the ball to earn MVP game honors. At LSU, Dewey settled in at defensive tackle for Coach Charlie McClendon. At 6'4", 245 pounds, A.J. used superior quickness and athletic ability to control the line of scrimmage. His explosiveness at the line wreaked havoc for blockers. A.J.'s best season as a Tiger saw LSU finish 9-3 and, and in second place in the SEC. He earned first-team All-Southeastern Conference honors, averaging 72 tackles and 27 tackles for loss. Top-notch for a defensive lineman. And he also earned SEC All-Academic honors. At the Senior Bowl, Dewey was voted the Outstanding Defensive Player for the South. One scouting report stated A.J. was spirited and fiercely competitive, so quick to rush the passer and so powerful in stopping the run. Dewey was such a dominating force at LSU that in 1977, the Miami Dolphins made A.J. Dewey the 13th overall choice in the first round of the NFL Draft. He immediately made his presence known by playing his way to Defensive Rookie of the Year honors. He switched to linebacker for the 1980 season where he was a beast on the blitz, amassing 84 tackles with five and a half sacks. A year later in 1981, he was second on the team with 110 tackles and added seven and a half sacks and was named first team all AFC by the United Press International. Dewey is perhaps best known for his legendary performance in the 1983 AFC Championship game dubbed as the Mud Bowl against the New York Jets. The Orange Bowl field was doused in water and mud due to a heavy rainstorm. After a scoreless first half, Dewey intercepted three Richard Todd passes and returned one 35 yards for a touchdown in a 14 to nothing win. sent Dewey and the Dolphins to their first of two Super Bowls. He was selected All-Pro twice and was named to the 1984 Pro Bowl. A.J.'s accomplishments occurred during eight NFL seasons where he often played injured. And those injuries eventually cut short his career with nine surgeries to his shoulders, knees, and wrists. Today, friends in the River Parishes remember Dewey as the small-town boy who played big-time football and never gave up on his dream. Let's welcome the All-State Sugar Bowl's Greater New Orleans Sports Hall of Fame, Class of 2018, football great Adam Joseph A.J. Dewey.